Are you considering getting a Wi-Fi thermostat? In today's video, I want to give you 10 reasons of why I think it might be a good idea for you to get a Wi-Fi thermostat. Some of these things maybe you haven't considered, some of these you have. Let's dive into it. Number one, I think that Wi-Fi thermostats make it easier to use your thermostat. And what I mean by that is, yeah, you can probably change your thermostat without getting up from the recliner just by switching the temperature on your phone. But I would say one step further than that, it removes geographic boundaries and it makes it easier for you to turn the heat up before you get home from work. It makes it easier for you to make a change without having to go to that thermostat every time. And we're gonna talk a little bit more about some of those changes you can make in just a moment. But overall, it just makes the entire experience easier than what it used to be. It's sort of like why we purchase things online today. When online shopping first came out, it used to be there was no retail locations, there was no overhead for the store, and prices were actually cheaper to buy them online. But today, that's not always the case. In fact, I would argue that sometimes it's even more expensive to buy online because you're purchasing how much more convenient it is. Number two, alerts and errors. A lot of today's thermostats will alert you or give you an error. It'll let you know that there's something wrong with that system. Some of those alerts can be set by you. Some of those alerts may go to your contractor, which is also something we're going to talk about later in this video. But ultimately, you can get alerts on your phone if it gets below a certain temperature. The example I use all the time, because this is a true story, is years ago, my wife and I went on vacation. It was during the winter, and we were going down to Hilton Head, South Carolina, when no one else goes, right? We were halfway there, and I got an alert on my phone that said, hey, it's gotten below 63 degrees in your house. And I was able to, from another state, go on my phone and turn on the heat for the cat. <coughs> but you can get all kinds of alerts. That might be one of the most powerful things with these thermostats. Number three, updates. If you have your thermostat connected to Wi-Fi, you'll be able to get updates from the manufacturer if any come out. I remember years ago, one of the thermostats that we installed, they came out with an update that you could make the text bigger on the thermostat. And if our customers did not have that thermostat connected to Wi-Fi, able to receive that update, they weren't able to get that feature. Number four, prices. It used to be quite a hike, quite a jump to go from a standard thermostat to a Wi-Fi thermostat. Today, I would argue that not only has that window closed, but in some cases, it's just as inexpensive to get a Wi-Fi thermostat. They're much more affordable. And if you haven't subscribed to our channel, please do, because from time to time, we will introduce some of these new thermostats when they come out. Number five, it can save you money. A lot of these thermostats have different types of features on them and a lot of them are meant to help save you money. Some of them can learn your system. If you have it set up to run a schedule, it can learn the amount of time it takes to reach that temperature. It can learn your home. It can learn when you're not home, but a lot of them do have many functions totally meant for you to save money. Number six, make changes to that thermostat. Now we're not just talking about the temperature. In some cases, these thermostats have a way for you to make changes from your phone without having to go into the programming. I know there are times when I go into the programming of mine and I actually change the schedule. There are different times of the year, I wanna switch it from one schedule to another and I'm able to do all of that from my phone without having to go into any crazy settings or set up inside that thermostat, I'll be able to do all that from my phone. Number seven, geofencing. What is geofencing? Essentially, the thermostat knows if you're home or not, if you have that feature turned on. A lot of thermostats that have the geofencing feature would not be able to do it if you don't have it connected to Wi-Fi. Number eight, cloud services. A lot of brands are now making thermostats with the ability to connect to a cloud-based system. Your contractor can sometimes monitor that thermostat. Sometimes in those cases, the contractor will know if something's wrong before you do. I know that's the case with the brand we install, which is Daikin. The contractor can actually get alerts if there's something amiss and know if something's wrong before it's a big problem. Cloud services also allow for manufacturers and other technicians reps 
technical support and things like that, being able to dial into your thermostat and run tests, figure out what's going on, if there's something wrong and so on. All of that would not be possible if you didn't connect it to the Wi-Fi. Number nine, accessories. A lot of today's Wi-Fi thermostats don't just control the heating and air system, but it might also be able to control some of the accessories you have installed with that system. Some of those accessories could include humidifiers, dehumidifiers, indoor air quality products, air monitoring, and a whole slew of different accessories that you could have installed with your heating and air system. And finally, number 10, a lot of today's Wi-Fi enabled thermostats can save you money on your utility bills. If you allow the utility company to connect to your smart thermostat, allowing them to do different things to try to alleviate strain at peak times on the electrical grid, then sometimes they will give you a savings. They'll actually send you money or give you money off of your utility bill every month. We have a few customers in our area that take advantage of that program. And I know that it's not specific to my area, Area because we help folks on our new HVACguide.com website and we've had several of them tell us about very similar programs in their areas. So that's my 10. Did I miss one? Is there a reason you considered a Wi-Fi thermostat that I didn't go over? I'd love to hear about that in the comments section. If you like this video, I think you'll like this one even more. It's where I go over some of the common odors that you could have coming from your vents and some of the possible causes. Thanks for watching. Hit that subscribe button. We'll see you next time.